Got a question over at the Facebook fan page about pain in your forearms when training. Uh, guy dropped a comment on the page. Thanks so much for doing that about pain he's been having for his forearms. Just started training about six, eight months ago. And he's trying to figure out what the heck is this pain doing? When's it going to go away? And it's messing my training up. Now, this hits home for me because I had it when I first started training as well. Probably about a year into my own personal training, um, I got it and I probably had it for well over a year just because I was dumb and I thought it was just a normal thing and it's something you got to keep pushing through and that's the exact opposite. But I know that it was an overuse kind of issue with me. It was something that I wasn't training arms like five days a week, but I was doing arms, I was doing heavy arms, I was doing, you know, tricep stuff, a lot of, you know, grip strength stuff and and doing the heavy rows and, and all that stuff that requires you to put that death grip on that bar. Um, and I was just taxing my forearms. And I remember that, especially when I first started training, um, that I was basically, my forearms were overtrained. That They're not a large muscle group, so, but you, if you think about it, a lot of your pulling exercises that makes up a big chunk of your workouts so that being said you got to be careful how much you're training them now one of the biggest suggestions that i could give you is just take time off not time off from everything but just that direct arm work number one being bicep curls especially with a straight bar uh, try to stay away from those for a little bit. Just put your wrists in a not n not a bad position or your forearms or anything like that. It, it's a great actually isolated bicep move, but it does put that direct strain on that forearm and puts a lot of strain and just um, tension in that area. So if you do those a lot, um, even with dumbbells, even with easy curl um, easy curl bars, you're gonna have that that direct tension on that on that area so stay away from that stuff don't do bicep curls for a while like I said I've seen guys take off for almost up to a month uh, when it came to trying to get rid of their their forearm pain uh, but it worked I mean they kind of dropped the curls uh, try to do uh, you can try some hammer curls start off with super lightweight because it's not necessarily the weight that you're using it's just you basically technically have an overuse injury so it's not gonna be necessarily the weight of course increase the weight is gonna make it more inflamed Try, pick up some lightweight five ten pounds start doing some hammer curls if your forearms are still kind of flaring up drop the weight and that's just basically telling you that you gotta take some time off um, between those you can also do reverse curls instead of grabbing it with your palms facing the ceiling you can grab it with your palms facing the ground uh, this takes a lot less um, a lot more sh stress off of the flexor muscle group in your forearms which is basically the bottom part and puts more on the extensors which is the top part of your forearm it puts more um, focus on that area you, you won't be able to do as much weight just because of that grip and it's kind of an awkward grip but you're still hitting the biceps and you're giving that 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 flexor area on your forearms some some time to rest okay you can also do massages I do a lot of ball massages where lacrosse ball tennis ball um, baseball uh, whatever kind of um, aggressive approach you want to take as far as how hard the ball is do that put the ball on a table put your forearm over that table and kind of work it up and down side to side twisting your your forearms and try to see if you can find any knots that have developed in your forearms from this overtraining um, and then just trying to kind of recuperate and kind of take care of themselves they intend to kind of knot up so try that try those massages um, stay away from training them for a little bit maybe two three four weeks you can you can work on that but don't worry about actually losing strength it's something that you've built this awesome foundation when it comes to your training uh, don't worry so much about losing um, losing that strength because you're gonna have it it's not gonna go anywhere as soon as you pick it back up uh, you're gonna have that strength right back okay you've already built that awesome foundation so the worst thing you can do is take some time with it not the worst thing the best thing you can do is take some time off let those forms relax when you get back into it after a few weeks do a little test do some lightweight curls see what happens to your forearms if you're still fired up take a break do not push through it don't listen to the guys in the forearms they're idiots um, a lot of those guys are just internet gurus who think they know everything okay so take that time off take it easy don't worry about losing strength and you will be better um, I promise you because I'm better and I don't have any pain anymore um, and, that, and, that's, and that's good so Thanks for the comment button. Any other questions you guys may have, post it up on the fan page. Drop a comment below this video, and I'll get to it as soon as I can. And I'll see you guys later.